I didn't know why I was an arrowhead. Scratch that. I knew why I was an arrowhead. But I didn't know why I thought it was a good idea to commit to being there. I told the guys in the group chat I'd be down for a meetup because I never thought one would actually happen. We were a bunch of broke guys who met on Twitter. Who would have thought we'd actually be able to swing a weekend in a sweet ass lake house in California? Evidently, Garrett was broke, but his parents were loaded. An offhanded comment about his parents' place led to the group chat's first serious conversation about meeting in person. And next thing I knew, I was about to be face to face with people who I'd had a good time passing the time with. But that's all I thought it would ever be, a way to pass time. It was a game changer to bring my virtual life into the real world, and I hoped I wouldn't regret it. Hey, how are you? But I did. Good, come on. I regretted it as soon as I saw him. He was real, not just a picture on a profile. And they would all be there, real. Damn, Devin. You're even better looking in person. No wonder you've got the body count of a serial killer, I guess. <laughs> so, am I the first one here? Yeah. Great. More time to dread the awkwardness that was to come. Great. Come on, I'll show you around. So how was it dry? Is this good for you? Well, it's better than good. So am I going to be sharing the room with anybody? Only if you want to. Ah, uh, it was going to be like that. You look stressed. I mean, I guess I'm a little nervous. Well, I know a good way for you to blow off some steam. Oh yeah? And how would I do that? You get some help. Blowing it off. So, what are the plans for the weekend? I'm thinking, like, tomorrow? Uh, not tomorrow, we're going today. Me and Jace already made plans for today. Okay. We're all going as a group. Hey! Hey! hey. How are you? It's good, good to see you. Good to see you. Thanks for the invite. No problem, thanks for coming. Yeah, Appreciate it. Yeah, so... Loosen up. Things got off to a good start. It's only gonna get better from here on out. I'm cool. But I wasn't. There were so many personalities under one roof. It was overwhelming. Maybe I was more of an introvert than I thought. Devin, what's up? I never expected you to be so quiet in person. I never expected him to be so hot. Yeah, well, it's kind of my thing. <laughs> well, you need a new thing. <laughs> You'll see. So, are you and Jace like yeah, well, a thing? No. <laughs> no. Not a chance. I mean, we've talked a lot, but he lives too far away, so. I but I have him this weekend. He's really interested in me, like for real. <sighs> yeah. Okay. I'll believe that. You know what? Um, how about we just get it out there, you know? Be honest with one another because. 
we've all been honest with each other online. It shouldn't be any different in person, right? Why are you being a weirdo? Come on. We all know each other, so there shouldn't be anything intimidating about this weekend. Who says I'm intimidated? I mean, just judging from your awful body language. Now that we have anything to say about your body, just about how it's coming off, that's all. Okay. <laughs> this is gonna be a good weekend, guys. Yeah. Yeah. We just gotta let it happen, okay? Well, I'm letting it, I swear. Good. I was relieved when the guy stopped paying as much attention to me and started paying more attention to each other. <laughs> I wasn't surprised that Jacob and Jace were all over each other. They flirted like fiends in the chat, and I was pretty sure there were a good amount of exchanges going on in private DMs. <laughs> 